Unraveling the power of language. Exercise our rights. Hello and welcome to our channel, where we dive into the fascinating world of the English language. Today, we're exploring a powerful phrase that's pivotal in both legal and everyday contexts. Exercise our rights. Understanding this expression is crucial for anyone looking to grasp the nuances of English, especially for those interested in topics related to law, politics, or social issues. Let's embark on this linguistic journey together. The phrase, exercise our rights, refers to the act of using or implementing rights that are legally or morally granted to individuals or groups. These rights could be anything from the right to vote, the right to free speech, the right to privacy, or any other entitlements provided by law or social agreement. To exercise, in this context, doesn't involve physical activity, as it might suggest in other settings. Instead, it means to put something into action or practice. When we exercise our rights, we are actively engaging with them, making use of them in our daily lives or in specific situations. Understanding the phrase, exercise our rights, is crucial for several reasons. Empowerment. Knowing your rights and how to exercise them empowers you to stand up for yourself and others in society. Active citizenship. It emphasizes the role of active citizenship, encouraging individuals to participate in democratic processes, like voting or peaceful protest. Legal context. In legal settings, understanding this phrase helps in recognizing the importance of asserting one's legal rights to protect against injustices or abuses. Let's look at some examples to see how this phrase is used in real-life scenarios. Voting in elections, every citizen should exercise their right to vote to have a say in their government. Freedom of speech, journalists exercise their right to free speech when they publish news stories that hold those in power accountable. Right to privacy, individuals exercise their right to privacy when they choose not to share personal information on social media platforms. Exercising your rights can be done in various ways, depending on the right in question. Stay informed. Know your rights by reading up on them through credible sources. Speak up. Use your voice, whether it's voting, expressing an opinion, or participating in peaceful protests. Seek legal help. If your rights are being violated, seeking legal assistance is a way to exercise your rights and protect them. Understanding and exercising our rights is fundamental to the functioning of a democratic society and personal freedom. We hope this video has shed light on the significance of the phrase, exercise our rights, and inspires you to actively engage with the rights you hold. Remember, knowledge is power, and in understanding our rights, we find the strength to protect and uphold them. Thank you for watching, and we look forward to exploring more fascinating aspects of the English language with you. Stay curious and empowered.